Hello everyone, my mother-in-law gave me this kitchen compost crock from Gardener Supply for Christmas. And I've been testing it out for the past week. And this morning I thought I would open it up and see how things are going. Let's open the lid. And as you can see, um, the lid has a filter which helps keep the odors down. Um, they're replaceable, I believe, every six months, but they've done a good job of keeping the odors down because this particular crock is setting on our kitchen counter. They come with these bio bags um, for liners. As you can see, this one's just about full. Got some banana peels and a variety of other things. We got some greens in there, some other banana peels, but uh, the thing's just about full and I know I don't have smell vision, but uh, after opening this up there's quite a few odors coming out of this crock, but you'd never know it when the lid's on. The crock also comes with a chrome colored handle and that's to make it easier to transport. Um, we're going to take this crock and empty it into a Rubbermaid worm bin that I have out in my laundry room um, and start a new one. Welcome to my worm bin. Um, it's been about a week since I've added any amount of substantial food to the bin so um, I was checking it this morning and noticed that it's mostly bedding, most of the food has been eaten down, and it's time to add some new food. So, perfect opportunity to empty the compost crock on the kitchen counter and start again. Okay, I've emptied some food into my bin. Um, as you can see, banana peels, various greens, some green beans cabbage leaves. Um, the bin, this bin's been going since about June. Um, it's been emptied a couple of times. At this point I'm going to cover this food with some additional newspaper bedding and seal everything back up. Here's a picture of the empty crock. As you can see there's a little liquid in the bottom. Um, and let me tell you, this thing stinks. So that's another testimony to how good the filter is and how good this design actually works because you wouldn't want this thing on the counter with the smells coming out of it right now. But I had no idea it was this bad because the lid and the filter were doing its job. Uh, so far, I would recommend the crock to anyone that's looking for something to store their kitchen scraps before they add them to their worm bin. 